to my channel. I hope that you all are having an amazing day on today. If you're interested in this wig right here, this is the Love Me Hair Straight Headband Wig. I think this is in like 16 inches and it was like $100 if I'm not mistaken. But if you're interested in it, I will link the video in for you guys as well as link it below. So, on today's video, y'all know I love my half wigs and I love the Outre Converted Cap half wig. So I got both Cascade Queen and I have the Converted Cap Wavy Baby. To me, these two are similar. The only difference I'm really seeing just off of the stock cards is that one is longer than the other one. So I was like, let me just do them together because honey, yeah. So stay tuned, I'm gonna do Cascade Queen first and then I'll follow it with Wavy Baby. And I'll play around more with this one over this one. All right, so stay tuned. queen honey because i wanted to do this 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 bang look but i did notice me trying to separate the hair to do a bang i got some filler hair sticking straight up so i aborted mission <laughs> and because i don't want to mess up this hair and i felt like it wasn't laying flat enough for me for me to cut a bang and me to feel comfortable cutting the bang because i just bought this okay with my own quaints and I don't want to waste my $15. Now, as a unit, if it starts to, you know, get more frizzy and more tangly, of course, I will play around with some other little styles with it. But just right now, I aborted mission. And because I ain't want to mess this wig up. Okay. But I do like this unit. I really didn't get, I got a few little snags. I didn't get any shedding, which I'm quite surprised by that. You guys saw the cap construction on the wig. I do love the cap construction. Now, they're saying you can pull out this updo 
And just for me trying it with the sensational one that I reviewed, um, maybe a couple videos ago, I would say that's a no-go because you're going to have a big poofy situation if you try to do a ponytail with this unit only because of the size of the cap. Now, if the cap was a little smaller, maybe you can get away with it. But I know with that sensational one, I can only pull it to a certain degree and it stopped and it stopped with like a big space in it so i don't know about this one i'll play around with it once i take it back off but this is cascade queen again she is a gorgeous unit and i love the color on it i have loved all the converted cap series that i have tried i think this is my third and fourth one if i'm not mistaken if i haven't tried more but I do love that now. I just wish the energy they put into these half wigs, they put into their regular wigs. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. So up next is Ms. Wavy Baby. Now I will do the up down hairstyle with this one, but I won't do too, too much manipulation only because I know it's going to get poofy and it's going to get frizzy. So stay tuned. <laughs>
on into the room. Come on into the room. Let's gather around and talk about these two Outtray Converted Cap wigs. Again, I tried on Cascade Queen first. And this right here is Wavy Baby, what I'm wearing right now. And I'm going to tell you, out of the two, honey, I'm choosing the one that's in this DR2 Cinnamon Wine Color, which is Cascade Queen. Why am I choosing that one? Because this one right here, this longer one, to me, it's the exact same wig, okay? The exact same half wig, except one is longer than the other. To me, that's the only difference between the two. Because to me, they're the same curl pattern. Let me just pull her out here. Same curl pattern, one just longer than the other one. Now, I do wish the fullness carried on throughout the half wig here because towards the end, it gets real thin to me, in my opinion. And the same thing for this one. So again, if you want length, go for Wavy Baby. Now, but if you just want something cute that's has kind of hassle-free, again, go for a Cascade Queen which was the shorter one out of the two. I hold up the stock cards again so you can see. Cascade Queen is the shorter one. Wavy Baby is the one I'm wearing right now, which is the longer one. Now, when you do play with these, they're going to frizz, they're going to get tangled, and this long one, I got shedding with it, whereas the shorter one, I did not get any shedding. So, which one am I picking? All day, any day, Cascade Queen, because why? I got less hassle with that one. And I think these were the same price and maybe a dollar or two difference. But I will link the price in for both of those just to make sure. And again, once you start playing with these Converti Cap half wigs, I noticed on every last single one that I have tried so far, whether it be Curl Strip, Pina Carlotta, or these two right here, you do get humping. They, didn't, they went and redid the inside of the cap construction, but they didn't give us less humping so like this one i got this hump pan down over here if you want to play around with styling options with them just keep in mind it's going to tangle it's going to frizz and you're probably going to get a little bit more shedding but overall i do think these are cute if you just want to wear them as a half wig hanging all day choose them if you want them because they have versatility i don't think these have as much versatility as your shorter outtrade converted cap series that's just in my opinion but you guys, if you made it this far and you haven't subscribed to the channel, by all means, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Thank you to those who have subscribed already. I thank you so much. And I hope that you have enjoyed this video and peace and blessings.